What's good? <clears throat> Jesus, Lord of mercy. <clears throat> Sorry about that. What's good, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. Double A have here. Please like, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, yes, as you can see um, by the headline or title, Black Man, you are under attack. You're <laughs> like, if you ever seen the movie um, Ghost with Patrick Swayze and uh, Whoopi Goldberg? And then um, Whoopi Goldberg was sent to uh, Demi Moore by Patrick Swayze to, to let her know that she's in trouble. And then um, <laughs> Whoopi Goldberg goes to Demi Moore and says, um, what, was her, what was Demi Moore's name in that movie? Damn, I can't remember her name. But she said, um, something girl, you in trouble. <laughs> and that's how, that's how it is for y'all, black men. You are in trouble. You're under attack. And this is who you are under attack by. Not solely by this uh, woman um, here, but by women just like this woman. Women who are confused. Women who hate black men so much that they wish that they can be them, if that makes any fucking sense. We hate better black men, one black man out of the picture, yet want to, you know, go around dressing, talking, and acting like men. It is the most interesting thing I've probably ever seen in my fucking life. But yes, nonetheless, you are under attack. And the sooner y'all realize that, the sooner we can, you know, do something about this. Now I'm gonna play this. Some things are gonna be said, obviously. I'm gonna I'm gonna comment here and there. Uh but this should be a relatively quick video. A partner in life who I know I can always depend on makes me happy. Does it bother you that the two of you can't have children together? I think it's inaccurate to say as two women, we can't have children. We can have children. But you can, not together. You but can. He asks a very simple question. Um, I'm going to rewind it so you yeah, could uh, see the question again. But he, he asks a very simple question like he typically does because I think of Jesse as a very simple person. Um, so he asks a very simple question and just watch the mental gymnastic that this person goes through to try and make sense of it instead of just answering the fucking question and have children together i think it's Oops, sorry about that it was really really awesome to have a partner in life who i know i can always depend on makes me happy does it bother you that the two of you can't have children together i think it's inaccurate to say as two women we can't have children we can have children but you can not together you but, can't get but again my with, heterosexual friends I, can't have children know, together that's either that's an abnormal situation normally a man and a woman can have a baby but due to some type of defect you do find cases where a woman might not be able to have children you know have a baby or a man can't make it but there's no way that you and another woman can get in bed and make a baby do you ever wonder well if god made me a homosexual and he intended for me to be with another woman, knowing that I would want a family, why did he make it possible for me to lay down with another woman and make a baby? Have you ever thought about that? I believe God has- Another simple question that he asked. Created all of us. So if God created the people who figured out how to help my heterosexual friends who very much want children, and the fact that he created a way for them to do that, that we as as a world, as a, as a as, as a people have figured out how to how to operate in those situations that leads me what the fuck is she talking about <laughs> like what the fuck are you talking he, yo the man asked you <laughs> yo, <laughs> oh yo yeah you, you can't make this shit up that that it is possible so it doesn't it doesn't feel weird and and you know you can you, you can ask me that. four different ways but do I'm not I'm that? never gonna think it's weird because do, it's who I am yeah but you're never gonna think it's weird because you're weird that's what the fuck queer means um yeah so you're never gonna think it's weird well actually I'm not even sure if I believe that you're never gonna say that it's weird you might think it's weird but you're never gonna say it's weird and I, and I don't expect you to because obviously that'll go against all your fucking training um, you know, so, but at the end of the day, we all, we all understand it to be strange. Again, this, and this isn't hate speech. This is the, the reality of the situation. Uh, when it, when, when, when you ask, when he's, when he's asking this woman, this question about, you know, how do you feel, you know, that you'll never be able to create a baby with your wife? Cause this woman is married. Um, she's playing mental gymnastics and saying that she can. No, you can't. 
that that's impossible you know so we're not even we're not even de- dealing with this in like the realm of reality so you know but this is the attack black man you know why she says that black man she says it because she's she's got her eye on your kid why because you don't have your eye on your kid i'm gonna say that again she has her eye on your kid why because you don't have your eye on your kid and that's what they do they come and they adopt these kids and foster care and stuff like that these kids that are abandoned and forgotten because you know they weren't planned for because you got you get a freaking a black man that's a, a no nothing knucklehead um and um a, a two dollar hoe you know not saying all all black women are two dollar hoes but you know when you go to the hood a lot of them these legs open more than fucking 7-elevens so that's that's the reality of it and, and and that's the conditions that these babies are being made so then these babies are free, freaking getting snatched up by these um lgbtq members and and they're they're, they're gonna quote unquote raise your kids the marxist way which is um that whole like you know takes a village and breaking down the nuclear family and we don't need a man to do it but yet this person wants to dress and act and talk like a man like i said it's very interesting you believe that children need the influence of a father and a mother i think children need the influence of people who love them and care about them how about a father and a mother do you believe- See, exactly so pretty much what he's doing is he's asking about the nuclear family and of course look look look, look. 99 percent of lgbtq uh members and activists are marxist okay that's that's just the reality of it they are against nuclear family they are against the bible they are against order (laughs) they stand for chaos and anarchy so whatever breaks or disrupts the order they're for believe that they need that influence of a father and a mother i have had too many friends who have been raised by single parents one as a military kid where i have had friends and i have had people in my community whose parents have died serving our country i have had too many people who i know and who i respect and who i love who have been raised by single parents dads or moms to believe that it is impossible to raise a no one says it's impossible okay um and this is very common when they try to uh, change the question and shit like that. No one said it's impossible. Obviously, it's, it's possible that you can have, you can come from a single parent household and make something of yourself. You know, um, look at LeBron James. Uh, you know, there's many people. Some people might even say Barack Obama, you know, because I'm pretty sure his father was AFK, then a motherfucker. But uh, not too sure. Um, y'all could correct me on that in the comments. But yeah, no one's sitting here saying that it's impossible. But the reality is, but when you look at the statistics, the 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 the, the rate at which you, the the amount of people, uh, kids, I guess, the kids that grow up, that become adults, that go on to lead successful lives, drops from regular family, like nuclear nuclear family settings, to single um, parent settings it drops there's a huge drop so based off the numbers if you plan on having a kid or if you want kids in life if you want your kids to succeed in life the numbers say you should be married or at least be together and raise that child together like in a nuclear family setting okay now if you don't give a fuck about your child that, or, or you're fucking about your life, do whatever, whatever the hell you want, which is what you, most of y'all doing anyway. But that's just the numbers, okay? That, that's just the cold, hard facts on that. Brilliant, loving, mature give a, child. Give me a yes or no to the question. Do you believe that the children, boys and girls, need the influence of their father and mother? I, I just answered your question. I'm sorry if you didn't understand I, I, Yeah, that. I miss it. I'm, I'm black. And- see, see what she tried to do there? She just tried to um, pretty much condescend on, on, on Jesse. You know, oh, I, I answered your question. No, you didn't. No, you fucking didn't answer the question. And I'll rewind it back just so y'all can see that she didn't answer the question. And then he also said, you know, in a yes or no. And she, she didn't. Um, but again, 
they try to change the narrative. They try to change the question, try to change everything because they know that it's they're, they're, it's, it's all it's all bullshit. That's why. There's there's no legs to stand on. Slow. Dads or moms to believe that it is impossible to raise a. I have had too many people, single parents, one as a military kid. Do you believe that they need that influence of a father and a mother? I have had too many friends who have been raised by single parents. One as a military kid where I have had friends and I have had people in my community whose parents have died serving our country. I have had too many people who I know and who I respect and who I love who have been raised by single parents, dads or moms, to believe that it is impossible to raise a brilliant, loving, mature give a, child. Give me a yes or no to the question. Do you believe that the children, boys and girls, need the influence of their father and mother. I, I just answered your question. I'm sorry if you didn't I, understand I, Yeah, that. I missed it. I'm, I'm black and slow. So, so <laughs> do, do they need the influence of a father and a mother? I think it is my belief that children need the influence of people who love them, care about them. Is that a no them. to my question? So, yes, she's against the nuclear family, i.e. you, black man. You are not a necessity, okay? Look at the way she's fucking dressed, nigga. Like, you know, like, come on. She's sitting here. She can't answer the question that Jesse's asking. She's dressed like a fucking man. She's saying that she has a wife. Like, it's real simple. And I, obviously, I know this is one person, but not a, a lot of them are like this. It's a lot. That's 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 the that's the wave right now, man. That's the wave. They don't need you. They can do what you do. Oh, I don't have to create a baby because I could just I could just take take Tayshawn's baby because he ain't he ain't worth shit anyway. You know, he don't care about his baby. The attacks on you, black man, and and who's leading the attack? Black women like this, other black women like Cynthia G that fucking thinks she's fucking smart, but she's not. She says a whole bunch of dumb shit. But she just says it in like a well, you know, well spoken manner, and then people, you know, just take it and run with it, misleading our freaking quote unquote black women, you know. So it's it's either you got people like this or people like that, you know. So this is a multi, like this war is going on, on so many different fronts, you know, and and it's happening right underneath your nose, black man, right underneath your nose. So. You know, we we have to we have to get to our right mind. That's the only way we're gonna stop this. I I I'm sorry I answered your question. As a Christian, do you believe in sin? I I do believe in sin, yeah. And what is sin? Um, I I for me the easiest way to explain it, especially for non Christians, is you know I try to I try to lead a life where I don't treat people differently than I want to be treated. So, what is sin? I, again, I'm I'm sorry that that we're missing each other, but I feel like I answered that question. To to treat people the way you like to be treated. Um, I felt like treating other people well. So when radical, well, this is pretty much it on that. 